It wasn't my fault, really. I mean, maybe, maybe it was, but it wasn't on purpose. You know it wasn't on purpose because I didn't scream FIRE! I mean, what is the point of lighting things on fire on purpose if you can yell FIRE! When it, you gonna do it? It was simple things that could happen to anyone, anyone, and that's why you should keep watching this video, especially the third one. That third one was really, really close. At the first time I was cooking, oh hi, I'm amazing, by the way, totally forgot. Uh, anyway, I was cooking sweet potato because I was really trying to get fit. Did it work? Nah, I'd rather have a burger. Since it takes a while to actually cook it, I just went to read a little and the boiling pan totally vanished from my mind. I totally forgot that it existed. Pen? Whose pen? Whose pen? I never heard of it. Only it turned off the, the stove. It is stove. I hope it is. When I smell burnt sweet potato. Believe me, it's a very specific smell. Well, until this day, the pen is pitch black. Or it isn't. I don't know, my mom threw it away. Well, that was the light one. A mistake that anybody can make. But the other two, I was pretty lucky. N the next one happened when I got myself a part-time job. Good times, good times. I was tricking my hair because it was cold and I get too lazy to deal with it. Turn off the strickner. Director, is a strickner, right? Thank you very much. Except that when I got home more than four hours later, I found the straightener turned on. Yet, it's still plugged in. When I finally turned it, it off, my green blanket was white and my mattress was starting to get Brown. I think I have a video that show that I showed my friends when it happened. If I have it, it's showing on the screen right now, and you can see my mess. <laughs> if you look closely, I think you can see that it's kind of green on these parts. I don't think you can see it. I don't know if you can see it. Now the last one. The last one is pretty hardcore. There I was while drying my hair again with the hair. I'm, I'm. Trying to have doubts. When I started to hear like a, a tick, 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 like bug steps when in paper, you know. Ugh. Then I got scared. What if it was a bug? What if it was a rat? What if it was a spidey spider? <gasps> I turned off the blow dry. Director, is blow dry right? Why, thank you, director. You're so useful. And the noise stopped. That happened like for three times. Three times until I decided to turn on the blow dry and see where the noise was coming from. That's when I saw the power plug sparking. And not because it was beautiful, it was sparky sparking with sparks. The thing is, there's a demon here in Brazil that invented the string pin plug. What happened? You have to use an adapter. Director is adapter, right? Oh, there it is. Something in that adapter and the power plug just didn't click. And guess what was right beside the plug? Yeah, my mattress. Again, the adapter melted. Literally melted. And I ruined my blow dryer. What? To, to to fantasy to be true then how come a blow dry turned into this yeah because the plug just the pin this part just wouldn't get out of the adapter because it melted in it so i have this now do i use it hell no i don't use it i learned my lesson yeah Danger! So be careful, people. Pay attention to what's around you. When you cook, pay attention to the cooking. I just think that's the deal. I mean, even when I'm right beside the pan, I still burn food. I'm not good at the kitchen. That's why I hate cooking.